the future looks bright. There are incredibly big plans to reimagine Harbor Place and downtown. And the harbor itself may be clean enough to swim in next year. The mural, a sign of pride, is also a prophecy that our Baltimore is changing. The Inner Harbor this Saturday night resembles a crowded New York sidewalk. Tourists see possibilities all around them. Definitely room for potential and more shops, more restaurants locally here in the Inner Harbor. Local shops are the best. They make it like really the heart of the city. The Inner Harbor ice rink, a staple of downtown, continues to draw families and potential professional skaters. Its seasonal presence also represents change. It's fun. It's just when you get off balance, you got to kind of like crouch like you're a turtle and then you get on balance, but overall I really like it. A new inner harbor is taking shape with plans for residential towers, retail and commercial space. What we did here universally was that people wanted to love Harbor Place again. They wanted new energy here. The Waterfront Partnership announced this week the harbor may be clean enough to swim in next year. The people's kayaking, people sailing, people fishing. We'll look at it and we'll notice every day there are herons out on that pier. Also this week, Mayor Scott outlined his downtown rise, the city's playbook to revitalize downtown. Focus areas include public safety, cleanliness, arts, culture, and entertainment. Visitors like what they're hearing. It's absolutely beautiful. It makes you want to come down to the Inner Harbor and just hang out with your family. Of course, this isn't going to happen overnight. It will be a work in progress. Reporting from the Inner Harbor, David Collins, WBAL-TV 11 News.